Do you like to take really old cars that are super slow and make them slightly faster and a whole lot more dangerous? We're back in B210. Today is catch up day and we have a lot of work to do. We are far from running. Yeah, <laughs> Marty showed up. Hello. There's Marty. So I think today our plan is to finish up a whole bunch of things. We got the uh, wiring harness in finally. Some of the plugs didn't go um, to like didn't hook up to the things that we need them to hook up to. So I think we had to order some different plugs. So we'll swap those out at some point. The fuel system is done. The electrical system is in the works. We've got a lot of things somewhat connected. Um, everything is marked up. So we're going to try to focus on that today so that at some point in the very, very near future, we can finally get this thing started. Uh, cause I think we've got to put a tune on it too. We've got to take all the security stuff off cause obviously putting a, um, solstice motor in a B210 has some challenges. So we're going to try to focus on wiring today and maybe a few other things depending on how far we get. So we have... We have too many different sizes of fuel lines so we're trying to make them fit together and play nice. So we have this one. We have a big fuel line. Big fuel line. That needs to go to little fuel line. That needs to go to little fuel line. And then go to this hose part. And then go to this, this hose, hose part. part. So we've made an adapter. Look at that craftsmanship. To, to make it Let's work. Craft, get don't in show them craftsmanship. There's no Look craftsman at that. involved in this. That's cutting, hammering, and soldering right there, guys. Guaranteed 30 feet or third gear. Now, does it work? Of course it works. Of course it works. He's confident before he even puts it together.
All right, our day is done here. So we'll catch you up. A whole lot of boring stuff was filmed today. Mostly wiring. Um, so it doesn't look like much was accomplished, but we feel like a whole lot was accomplished. So we'll give you a little walk through so you can see what we did. The fuel system is done, so we closed all of this up back here. It's our steering wheel. We'll put the steering wheel back in at some point. Um, and then coming over to the other side. So what we did today was we got our um, box mounted with our new switches. Um, after we put the steering wheel in though, I think it might be a little bit too close. So we're gonna cut a hole in that and recess it. Uh, Justin actually got the, let me get down here, transmission tunnel. See how beautiful this is. Welded up really nice. So all of that is closed up. Uh, we did a whole bunch of wiring stuff. I think um, there's just a whole bunch of mangled wires. So we un unclipped everything that we had before because we have to swap out the battery and stuff like that and rerun some things off the new motor. But everything is still coming along. So here's a little, little motor shot. Uh, we finally got the starter wired up today. It's a thumbs up from Alan. He's happy. But progress was made today. I think wiring is our biggest thing right now. Once we get everything wired up and good to go, then we can work on trying to start it. So... That's where we leave you for this episode of the Lemons Build 2020. We're gonna upholster the whole interior with that purple fluffy stuff anyway, so. I mean. No, we're gonna throw um, glue at the doors and glitter them. Oh, the inside. So that they're fancy. The inside. What are you doing? <laughs> we take we that are. crap that ain't supposed to work, we making it work. All right. Fuel system, done. And testing. No leaks. No leaks.